2023 was one of the hottest years ever recorded, and experts say it's certainly not a fluke. Climate change means higher temperatures are probably here to stay. 12 News journalist William Pitts breaks down the numbers and what's in store for the new year. 2023 was really, really hot. Summer never really seemed to end. 54 days over 110 degrees, 111 days over 100 degrees. It feels much busier uh, and it feels people are much sicker. Hospitals were packed. It takes a big strain on people's health. Heat or things related to heat killed a record number of people, almost 500. So much heat and so hot that even cacti couldn't handle it. At a certain temperature for a certain length of time, they just can't do it anymore. The data is pretty clear. From 1880 to 1970, there's a pretty slow, gradual increase in temperatures. But from 1970 to today, that change is much more dramatic. And this is not just here and there around the country. This data is for the entire world. The trend is unmistakable. Peter Gerard with Climate Central, a nonprofit that tracks climate data, says this was by far the hottest year on record. Consistently, we're seeing temperatures that are three and four and five times more likely because of the influence of climate change. But more than heat, it's the rate that temperatures are increasing. According to NASA climate data, it's getting hotter faster. And Climate Central says there's probably no relief in sight. And you're seeing it across the entire U.S. West. You know, we had this brief span where we talked about the end of the drought. Um, it's not the end of the drought. Gerard says Climate Central is forecasting more record temperatures in the coming year, a year that will almost be as hot as 2023. William Pitts, 12 News. Okay.